Hello, welcome to our video series on the Digital Observation Technology Skills Kits. My name is Justin Uffham, and I'm a State Specialist for Environmental Education at the University of Wisconsin Extension's Department of Youth Development. Today we're going to look at the Kintrex Infrared Thermometer. And this device is pretty affordable and easily found in hardware stores, hobby stores, as well as online. I first saw this being used in energy audits and in habitat surveys, but you may find many other additional ways to use this tool in your own education. Hello. Today we will be demonstrating how to use the Kintrex infrared thermometer. This is the infrared thermometer. It is a dedicated device used to measure the surface temperatures of different objects. The infrared thermometer is a very simple tool to use which will spark the imagination of its users to ask questions as to why something is colder or hotter than an object around it. This tool has only two buttons. The first button, shown here, when pressed and held with your index finger, projects a red laser, reading the surface temperature of where that laser is aimed. The temperature reading is then displayed on the screen, shown here. You can use this tool to simply take the surface temperature of any object. We use it to compare and contrast the surface temperatures of various biotic and abiotic objects found around our observation areas. The other button, shown here, allows you to quickly change between Celsius or Fahrenheit units. When using the infrared thermometer with your students, it's important to mention safety concerns before beginning an activity. Since it shoots a laser, we ask that the students do not point the laser at or near anyone's face. If you would like more information on specific uses for this tool, please visit our website and check out our FACT troubleshooting page. What types of careers and job skills do you think that the infrared thermometer could be used for? Please leave your answers in the comment section below. Hi, Justin Huffam again. Thanks for your interest in the Digital Observation Technology Skills Kit. If you'd like to learn more about what we're doing with the DOTS kits, check us out on our YouTube channel or on our website. There's a lot of ways mobile technologies can influence your environmental education objectives and we're glad to support that.